Hello, welcome to this overview of the Xerox Book Center solution, a walk-up self-service book and document scanning kiosk. So let's get started. Here you'll see a list of available destinations that can be configured on the Xerox Book Center, including scanning to email, USB drives, Google Docs, as well as Google Drive, using any Gmail account or Google Apps for that matter. We also have the ability to create new collections on the fly within both Google Docs and Google Drive. There's a patent pending solution from Scanix for scanning to any smartphone or tablet, which I'll demonstrate during this overview. But before I do, we can also scan to printers, however many you would like to configure, whether that be black and white in color. We work with all of the well-known print release environments, such as Envisionware and Pharos, Papercut and GoPrint, or you can simply connect a USB or a network connected printer to the Book Center. We also support a faxing service from Scanix, which allows faxing with no phone line, no setup fees, and no monthly fees. You only pay for usage. I'm very excited to announce that we have a partnership with OCLC for scanning to their new article exchange cloud-based delivery service, as well as scanning to Iliad and Odyssey for traditional interlibrary loan requests. Last but not least, the ability to scan to both FTP and network shares. So let's select smartphone and move on. Here you will choose from a list of available scan settings and for this demonstration we'll do color, high quality PDF, but keep in mind you can change to other scan settings and file formats by simply selecting it on the screen. Moving on, you will see an illustration of the patented book edge scanner with a book properly aligned. You'll also see the copyright notice. Scanning is as easy as touching the big green scan button and in under five seconds we have cropped, rotated, and enhanced the image no matter where a document or a book is placed on the scanner. Let's scan the back side of this data sheet. Again, very quickly, you see a perfectly cropped and rotated image. You also have nice thumbnails for ease of navigation through your scanned images in a scan job. I also have the ability to select a crop area and here I'll draw around the solution and apply the crop. There's also a unique feature for retaining the document original. So let's go ahead and apply the crop. What you'll notice is the document as well as the cropped image. This becomes very important if you're scanning magazine articles, for example, where you can capture just a picture of the editor and potentially you want to grab some of the features or highlights, which I'll do now. And applying the crop by not retaining the original will give me those two nice bits of information I was looking for without the need to scan multiple times. So let's move on. Here the document is securely transferred to the Scanix cloud service where a QR code is displayed. The patron simply scans the QR code and almost instantly the document that was delivered is now secure on my iPhone. It's just that easy. I have two options to scan more or simply say I'm done. For now, I'm going to go back and scan more. However, this time when I scan, I would like you to pause this YouTube video and capture the QR code yourself to see the magic happen. So again, we'll scan in color, high quality PDF. We'll hit the big green scan button, which will capture, crop, rotate, and enhance the image perfectly every time. We'll go ahead and grab the back side of this Xerox Book Center data sheet. And now we're ready for delivery. Moving on, again, the document is securely transferred to the Scanix cloud service and a QR code will be displayed. Please pause the video at this time and capture the QR code. If you have not paused the video, I'm capturing the QR code now so that we can move on. And this document has now been securely transferred to my smartphone. I'll simply say I'm done and now I'm back to the home screen. Please note that every time this home screen is displayed, any bit of information that was gathered about the previous use, including passwords, usernames, and temporary images, have been purged for confidentiality and privacy concerns. I invite you to view the other videos on the Xerox Book Center for very specific information about scanning to each destination. Thank you again for watching this overview of the Xerox 
book center product.